Hello guys, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. Today we are in the brand new Piper 38 Tomahawk, the PA38 Tomahawk. Just brand new from, from Just Flight. It, it was released, let's say, yeah, some days ago. This plane is brand new, there was already coming, on, coming out a new update. I don't have this new update to be honest, but I'm happy with the version I have at the moment with the first version. This plane is working really, really nice. It's flying really nice, it sounds nice, it looks nice, especially from the cockpit and also from outside. This plane is a must-have in my opinion. I really, This plane is really a must-have. Especially for VFR flying, this plane is absolutely amazing. And on YouTube, this plane is getting kind of... Um, this plane in this simulator, I mean of course in the MSFS 2020 scene, this plane is getting kind of famous at the moment for one really interesting and special reason because of the um okay hopefully yeah that was just a little a little, a little lag there um for a really interesting reason because this plane is famous for its great spin abilities in the simulator so of course there are also different planes that are spinning really good in the simulator um but this plane is spinning extremely extremely nice and really really realistic and this 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 plane has a little nickname, a little fun name called Traumahawk. Also for a reason, because um, this plane is not getting out of a fully developed spin. If you thank you, if you put all the weathers into the neutral direction, because in most of the planes, in most of the Chevrolet aviation planes, doesn't matter if it's in the I've already tried it out in the Cessna 152 in MSFS. I've already tried it out in the Piper 24 from A to A simulations, just leaving all the controls into the neutral position if you are already in a spin. And what happened was that the plane di almost directly stopped the spin. In this plane, this is not happening. I don't know what is the explanation for this, I don't know why this is happening, but this plane is not getting out of a spin if you leave all the controls into the neutral position. So, as some of you know, the standard procedure um, for stopping the spin is just getting full full water um, in the opposite direction of the spin that's in, in basically all the general aviation aircrafts stopping a spin as fast as possible in this plane this procedure is of course also um, helping to get out of spin so we are going to do now what we're going to do now is we're going to do two spins and the first spins we are going to apply full water in the opposite direction to stop the spin. So we are always spinning to the left. And in the second one, in the, in the second spin, what we will do is, in the second one, we will simulate that our waters, these two water pedals here, are not working. They are stuck, they are whatever, they are just not working anymore. And now you probably think, okay, if this plane is not getting out of a spin by leaving all the controls in the neutral position, how should this plane get out of the spin if the waters are not working, if this water here is not working? And that's what I will show you after the first spin. So first of all guys, power comes back, we will increase this turn here a little bit and decrease the speed, as you can see the speed is slowing down below 50 and now there comes the shaking and the noise and now we'll apply full water in the spin direction pulling all the way on the yoke, we are in a fully developed spin. Power to idle, and there's the spin, and now full water in the opposite direction, and you can see it takes the aircraft some spins, even with full opposite water applied, it takes the aircraft some spins, I didn't count them, but some spins um, to stop the spin. So that's already something we, we noticed. Um, but as you can see it is working with the water. It works with the water really good. You can get out of the spin with the water and that's simply how it works. But now let's say that the waters, let's say where we are, uh, let's see where we are, okay. Let's say that the waters are not working guys. What are we doing if the if the waters are not working, if the water pedal is not working? So, to entry the spin, of course, we are going to use the waters now, but as soon as we are in the spin, we will take I will take my feet away from the waters, from the water pedals, 
um, below my table and then I will show you a little trick a little yes a little trick to get out of the spin without using the runners and that is working guys that is working really good it is doing even longer but it is working so let's get the plane into the spin first of all power comes back let's say to idle already there comes the spin water in the spin direction there comes the spin and okay now we are in a fully developed spin one us to neutral we can see okay nothing is happening full left aileron and the plane is out of the spin and i would say that i was wrong with i uh, with what i said before because that was actually not during um much longer than before with the op opposite runner so as you can see there are two ways to get out of the spin the first way is to give um full opposite runner that is also working really nice but what is also working but actually yes taking a little bit longer is to apply full left aileron in this case so simply full aileron in the direction of the spin what was happening is the spin was getting really tight and really um, with mu much you know with with the nose down the nose was getting down with every spin the nose was getting a little bit more down what resulted in a controlled dive and if we are in a controlled dive of course the plane isn't in a spin anymore the plane is flying again and then you, you simply know okay you can pull up the plane again and that's also a way to get this plane out of the spin guys this plane is really really interesting it's this plane is really um amazing to fly really realistic with what you can do in this plane and yeah absolutely amazing to to just learn how yeah simply simply to learn how to how to deal with spins in the simulator with this plane guys i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you liked it and i will see you in the next video um probably in the stream so yeah see you next time bye bye